So up tonight with Eve Pons, we'll go ahead and uh, take, uh, go ahead and use the raise your hand function for Eve. Start with Rob and then go to Gustavo. Eve, it looked like you guys had a lot more chemistry on offense tonight than you did in the first three games. Would you agree with that? And if so, you know, what do you think, why do you think that was? Yeah, definitely. Uh, we're trying to be uh, more aggressive offensively. Uh, we're trying to have a better execution and uh, do what we practice. Uh, we're trying to get better every game. And that's why today we got better. So we got to keep it going. Eve, nice to talk to you again, you know, nice to see you play, you know. And what do you see in terms of the chemistry you guys building, you know, you and Folky being the kind of the uh, seniors, you know, the more experienced players on this team, you know, and even Folky tonight kind of, you know, helping on and off the court. How do you see this chemistry of this team being built and you and Folky kind of being the leaders of this team? Yeah, so just like you said, you got, you got to show the, the way. Uh, we're trying to lead the, the team the best we can. And uh, so we're trying to bridge this uh, commercial, uh, trying to get better, um, uh, lead the younger guys, and try to help them out. I'll go to David Pascal and Wes Rucker. Can you talk about just what it's like having those two freshmen coming off the bench? And I think they scored 24 points in the first half. What that? What's that like, just having them come in so early and do what they do? Oh, it's amazing. I mean, we have uh, uh, those, those two guys already. Uh, good guys. Uh, they bring a lot of energy on the floor. Um, they're willing to play to, to play really hard, uh, both uh, offensively and defensively. Uh, those guys are great value. We have more coming up on the bench, and everybody's trying to uh, to bring in every time. Eve, when when you it looked like in those first few games you, you were getting a lot of those mid range looks that that you really like, and and they just they weren't dropping. How, how frustrating was that? I know it's been a, a long off season, and I know you wanted to. To get going quicker, uh, wh what made some of those more of those fall tonight? Yeah, well, I'm not really worried about it. Um, I'm kind of trying to find my rhythm uh, still. Uh, that was a weird um, offseason, like you said. Uh, we had a lot of open down, stopping, coming back to the gym, um, practicing on my own. So I got to find my rhythm, but I'm not worried about it. I'm going to still keep it going, what I do best, play defense, with only run, executing offense. And I know the rest, you know, care of the offense. Nicholas Hill and then Troy. So I'm obviously another game where you guys hold Tennessee Tech to under 50 points. Just talk about what it means to have four straight games where you guys came out and played really, really well on the defensive side of the ball. Can you repeat a question, please? All right. Um, yeah. Um, essentially, just four straight uh, four straight game where. You guys came out and played really well on defense. Um, second straight game that um, has held the opponent to under 50. Just talk about what it means to have four straight games where you guys played really well on the defensive side of the ball. You know, the team's defensive execution through four games, holding out each opponent under 60 points. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, I mean, this is what we do. I mean, uh, we are a defensive team, so we're trying to uh, we have our, to meet our goals um, to have uh, less than uh, 65 um, points. And that's what we've been doing. So we just need to um, keep it going, uh, do all the practice, play defense really hard, and uh, try to hold our opponents uh, under 65 points. Go to Troy and Wes Rucker. Eve, you mentioned still being confident in your offensive game, but for you, what does that kind of mean? I guess what? How did you? How do you know you feel comfortable within the offense on a on a game by game basis? Um, I know what I got to do uh, on the offensive end, trying to execute, take over the ball, and um, I know if I have an open shot, I'm going to take it. Uh, I'm confident in taking any shot on the floor, and uh, right now uh, my person is not good, but I know it's getting uh, it's getting better. Uh, I'm getting I'm getting my rhythm back. And uh, so I'm not worried about it. <clears throat> Eva, I know you, you take a lot of pride in, in the way you play defense and, and want to be one of the best defenders, if, if not the best defender in college basketball. Do, do you think this, this defense as a team can be the best team defense in college basketball? I think our team can be one of the best uh, defensive teams um, that ever played. Um, I think we have great guys. Uh, that can play defense on anybody on the floor. 
and uh, the energy we bring, uh, the way we play hard, I think we have one of the best defensive team in our country. All right, we'll take one last call for questions. All right, fantastic, Eve. Thank you very much. Thank you. I did respond in the chat. I